What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Uh, hey, what's going on, people? I'm back in the building. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Well, you know all the a.k.a.s. I don't have to go in on them. You know, I'm just here. Hold on, let me stretch real quick. Just... Here to give you another one of my, you know, one of my diatribes, as I like to say. You know, hold on, let me adjust this real quick. There we go, back in building, back in business. Where I ain't gonna take the whole video doing this. There we go. Well, I think I kind of fucked it up, didn't I? Let me go back. Alright. Today we're gonna talk about Brazil. And as you well know, Brazil is hosting the World Cup. Yes, as you can find out, I, I got to wait a minute to adjust this camera, so I had to go in because I wasn't going to take the whole video doing that. So, Brazil's hosting the World Cup, and apparently Brazil loves soccer, but they hate their social programs. Let me go in. As I said the last two times, even the third time since you want to be so smart asses, Brazil is hosting the FIFA World Cup. Now, this is this is the largest sporting event in the world outside of the United States. Everybody and their brother, probably Canada too, but uh, everybody and their brother is into soccer, you're av but your average Brazilian, and it's being held in Brazil, which is, uh, like I said, it's one of the BRIC countries. If you don't know what it is, it's a BRIC country. Look it up. You know, it's uh, Brazil, Russia, India, and China. Look this all up. They just found oil off, off the coast of Rio. They got large reserves. They use ethanol for gas uh, off, off of sugar cane. Look all this up and help me out. But uh, to the average Brazilian, they're upset that a lot of their social programs, like I, I know for a fact, their transit system has received ridiculous hikes because of this. Like they, they, they hiked their, some of their buses and subways, they jacked them up to cover the cost. Like, like I said, the, I mean, the month, like, you know, like I said, the average Brazilian is like, probably can't go to like to this, but and they're saying, well, we gotta pay for it. Why can't we go to this? You know, like oh, and even though the money has been spent, Brazil has a lot of, you know, I don't say they have a lot of chops. What they did is they, they do the same thing everywhere. What they did is, and I'll use a section of Brazil, a Copacabana Beach. If you know where Copacabana is. Fun. If it's not just a Barry Manilow song, but uh, Oak Cabana Beach, if you look high above it, or if you've been above that, it's the Flavellas. And like the Flavellas, or like, as you would say in America, the quote unquote, the hood. Now in the Flavella, that's where, it, that's where a lot of the poor people are. They're not, they start off as government shanty towns, but they developed into a, a, their own thriving system, like, it's like let me tell you people it's real in the full well let me I, I can tell you this for a fact it's real in the full well but uh it's it's, a, uh, it's its own system okay so what they start doing they start tearing out some of these houses in the full well full i gotta i'm my portuguese is rusty so excuse me they start tearing down houses in the full because now it's like it's 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 like how it is here in america the inner city is starting to become prime real estate because people are starting to move back to the cities and they don't want a long commute. But in Brazil, it's done differently. The favelas are all on top of the hills as far as looking down over the city. Well, how can I look? How can I put this? Imagine Denver. Y'all know Denver's like Denver's in like the Rocky Mountain Basin. You know what I mean? Imagine if all the hoods in Denver were around the city looking down towards the city 
which makes it a scary fucking thought if you think about it. Somebody one of the knuckles shooting down there and do something, which that does happen, by the way. But it's kind of like that. That's how Rio is set up. And then, like they did, and we're going to the favelas and tearing stuff down, and they're they're basically either taking land or people are putting money into it. So, and that's another reason people are getting upset because a lot of people are losing their property. Like I said, it's just it's been done. It's done getting done here in the states. So, ain't no difference. But the people were just mad at the fact that a lot of these social programs like schooling, transit, health care, you know, education, which I said, medical, the government could have used the money more wisely than what they did. And truth be told, when I heard most of the stadiums were not ready. So, I don't know, Brazil's starting to, starting to have pains and aches like we do, we do or we did. So, I want to stay tuned to this and Go Brazil. Peace.